Good morning, this is Lindy. I've started this before, but some of it doesn't make any sense, so I have to redo things, you know, because my train of thoughts just fly right out the window. So, today, which is Sunday, I want to talk about uh, the experiences through life and learning from those experiences. So, you know, sometimes I'm not too forgiving. <laughs> Depends on what it is. <laughs> so I, when I was working at KFC and living in the lot, 2011, 2013. I mean, I worked at KFC for five years. So I worked until 2016, from 2011 to 2016. We saw many things, <laughs> many sides of people. Trust me, uh, they really show show their colors. Anyway, so one day, I think it was a, I want to say it was a Saturday, but I don't think so. I think it was like a Thursday. I always did the drive through window. I was the opener, and uh, we would open up the drive through window before we would open up the front. So I would do the drive through window. And one day, I had a line of customers, but I had two vehicles. Uh, one was a van and one was just a regular car and for some and we have the microphones on so I can hear what's going on in that line I can hear it so all of a sudden one day I'm starting to take this woman's order and someone's screaming just get a little faster can't you place your order fit anyway the woman behind her was yelling at this woman place her order faster she was way too slow she was in a hurry could she just get done with it I mean it was really nasty it was the things she was saying were really nasty well that's first time we had an incident like that where two customers are fighting in the bar in, because one's too slow so the woman who was placing the order just ignored her she never responded this woman's just yelling like crazy she wasn't honking you know, just spouting this, spouting that. And the woman's place, she finally gets her order placed. And she drives up to the window. And I said to her, I'm so sorry. I, I, I've never seen anything like that. I don't know what's wrong with that woman. <laughs> that is really horrible. And she looked at me and she goes, take her order. I went, what? She goes, take her order. I want to pay for it. I said, why? And she goes, just take her order. I want to pay for her order. So she's sitting in my window because she's not paid for hers yet. So I take the other woman's order. It was, you know, like a $10 order, whatever. And um, this woman, I, so I said, okay, this is how much she, she bought. So she gives me the money for both orders. And she said, would you please tell this woman I hope this starts her day better and she has a better day. I'm like, oh man, you know, that's really kind. Because this woman was horrible. That it was really a kindness. So, a woman gets up to the window and uh, she says, how about, you know, I said, no, it's free. And she goes, what do you mean it's free? I said, the lady that you were yelling at in front of you paid for your meal. And she hopes you have a better day. And this woman burst into tears. And through her tears and her crying, she tells me that she has just left her doctor. And they just informed her she has fourth stage cancer, unoperable, and she has so many months to live. So many months to live. And so she was taking her anger and her feelings and her, f she's frightened uh, out on the woman in front of her at the KFC drive through So I think this message is you never know what that other person is going through. I mean, I talked to this woman for a long time. Um, I had her come inside. I said, don't drive while you're crying. And I served her meal inside. 
We had a long talk. She passed away four or five months later. But um, it was it was a lesson for me that not to get upset because someone's behind you or, or saying something. You don't know why they're so angry. You don't know why they're doing something. But this woman did such a kindness that it cracked open that shell and it, it relieved all that inter in, internal whatever you want to say. I had never thought about that. I just, I would go, oh, that's such a dumb person. Oh, what's their problem? And when you think about what other people go through, you don't know. So when they're angry, they're not angry at you. They're angry at something else. And the kindness, any kind of kindness, whether you say, oh, that's a pretty shirt, or, oh, you're so lovely, I love your hair. So if you, if you have something nice to say to somebody, no matter what, you'll find it might help somebody. I just thought you might enjoy that, that story of what that woman did because she was beyond kind. I, ne I would have never done it. After I saw that, now I do it. I, I would do, I've done that now if people are angry or something. But it's something to think about. You're not in the other person's shoes. You don't know what they're feeling or what they've been told or what's happening. So don't always get upset because they're mean. They may not be mean. They're just miserable. So you have a great day. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Oh, don't forget to hit the like button. Camera.